climate activists marched in Goma, the Democratic Republic of Congo, on Friday in protest of the government's plans to exploit 30 oil and gas blocks in the country. The environment must be preserved in all its forms. Oil is a danger for the population. We have the example of Luanda, the example of Nigeria, where the people are impoverished because of the exploitation of oil to the detriment of multinationals. That's why today the population of North Kivu, through this march, shows its discontent against oil. The Congolese government caused an uproar among environmentalists last year by putting 30 oil and gas blocks up for auction, including 13 blocks crisscrossing through protected areas and national parks. Most of the world's ecosystems subsist on what we have in the DRC, and if the DRC proceeds with the sale of 30 oil blocks, it will not only destroy the Congolese ecosystem but also the global ecosystem. A week before the planned protest, the United Nations warns that countries are way off track to curb warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius since pre-industrial times as agreed in Paris in 2015. To all the people who have gathered in New York to talk about the ecological future, tell them that in Congo we have launched the sale of oil blocks, but today humanity is fighting fossil fuel industries. The Congo Basin Forest absorbs 1.5 billion tons of carbon dioxide, some of which would be released into the atmosphere if the areas are cleared for oil and gas drilling.